Thanks to everyone who has subscribed. If you have not, please do. And thanks for coming out here. I really appreciate you. See conditions for attending Kanu's parents' burial by Nigerian police. The Nigerian police have listed condition for attending Kanu's parents' burial for those who want to attend the ceremony. More facts are coming from Nigerian police as tweeted by Mazi Kano. Nigerian police are not smiling as they give conditions for anybody that wants to attend the burial ceremony of a leader of IPOB Leeds' parents. If you really love Kano's parents and want to attend the burial, this is what the Nigerian police order you not to appear with, come or wear on the burial day. The Nigerian police vow that failure to obey these orders, that the burial of the late King and Lolo of Kano's parents will not hold. These items include the Biafra flag or anyone wearing those colors in the form of mufti, if found, will be thrown out and dealt with accordingly. What's this nonsense I'm seeing here? These are conditions for attending. Wow. I did not know that uh, Mazi and Lolo Kanu were this important in Nigerian community. And the Nigerian government did not pay due homage and uh, uh, give them their due the, the, the dividends every month, allowances and allocation as they should. It's very surprising that they waited for the parents to die before they started according them the respect and the honor that should be due them. Wow. Very strange. Nigerian police in Umaya doing this. Ah. This is unbecoming, oh. Nay, this is unbecoming. That Nigerian police all of a sudden have become very, uh, uh, have, be have began to show respect for Nandis Kano's parents and uh, actually calling for people to, to not wear what they want to wear for the barrier that they don't want to see people wearing the uh, biafra flag be bearing up the flag or uh, wearing um, the clothes relating to the color in the form of um, flagging the flag this is really strange very strange i mean this is i don't i don't i'm trying to understand it you know nigerians I will tell you a little thing about the Nigeria, about the Nigerian uh, soldiers and army and um, the, these people that are supposed to be law enforcement agency. They don't have a mind of their own. None of them are true heroes or leaders. They are all followers and blind followers. Yes, that's what they are. Blind dogs, all led by a, a bunch of blind, uh, b b b blind dogs. How can someone be coming for a barrier and all you have to say is giving conditions for the people to come to the barrier telling the people not to wear um, um anything relating to the flag color you know wearing it in the form to show that and uh, they are they are in support of nandi kano how come you are how come this this is really this is really uh, i I'm, I'm really trying to get what nigerian government is driving at this is not what the government should be focusing on or doing there are more issues on ground there are more things in nigeria there are more actions that more things that need attention maybe i think what will happen is that uh, please uh, I, I, to, I, I want to say to the leader please i think that uh, even after your parents burial the nigerian police should not leave they should stay and protect the life and property of the people because uh, I can't believe that because of this barrier, all these uh, ceremonies and things have been put in place. Hey, you see, I'm really speechless. The Nigerian police have come up to say that anyone that wants to attend, that they are out there for some weeks now, almost a month, there have been heavy military presence in the hometown of uh, Unandikano. And the uh, police, the commissioner of police of the state and all that, these are supposed to be um, proper Igbo men. 
These are supposed to be sons of the soil. But guess what? They are the ones actually being used by the, by the, by the, by the government to deal with uh, um, the Biafrans. I can't believe this, that real sons of the soil cannot speak for what is right and cannot support their own. These are the kind of people that will betray one. These are betrayers. They are not true leaders. These are betrayers. So people, please watch out. They are betrayers. They are not, they are not true Nigerians. They don't, have the, the, they don't have the Biafra spirit. No, they don't. They are serious betrayers. So my people, be wise. Don't put these people around you or anywhere close to you. They are there to cause trouble. You know, how can they be supporting uh, Bia, uh, Buhari and his people like this? I'm really short of words because I'm surprised that they are the ones, you know, be, being used. They are the scapegoat. They are the dogs. The, 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 I, don't, I, I lack words to call them. Being used by the government to, to, to inflict pain on Biafrans and Unandikano. Unandikano is presently not in the country, you know. He's, he's presently not in the country because uh, the Nigerian government, we are, we are tagging him, uh, someone that wants to break national peace, you know. They have not called my ACL, they've not said anything about my ACL breaking national peace. So it's Unandikano that is crying for the revolution of people, crying for better life for people that is uh, breaking peace. You see what I mean? So they've not called for the real, they've not called for the real, they've not faced the real issue. They are, they are, put, they are uh, uh, pointing finger in the wrong direction. Please, my people, let's, let's not answer this government. Let's come there with a heart to bury uh, late Mazi and Lolo. Let's give them a befitting barrier. Let's make uh, the great leader, Nandi Kanu, not feel the absence. You know, not, let's not make him feel that um, him not being there did not make his parents to be properly buried. Let's give him all the support that he needs at this, at this time. The parents can only bur be buried but once. After that, the Nigerian government have nothing, nothing else for bait. It is because of the parents' burial that they are, that they are having these baits and they are, they, are, they are using it as a bait for the, for the Biafrans, you know. But after this, after this burial, they don't have any other, any other form of bait. So that's why, please, let's, let's um, put things in order. Let's come. Let's make, uh, let's make that day glorious. Let's support. Let's make it a wonderful day. Okay? Let's make it a wonderful day. Let's not allow evil to prevail. Let's not allow evil to prevail. Because they are looking for people that they will kill. You will not be part of them. I will not be part of them. It's Mazi and Lolo that have... That have, uh, that have passed on. They've lived a good life and they have passed on. They are the ones to be buried. We're not going to bury our young men, uh, young women along with them. That's not the way it goes. When parents die, they, 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 their children, their children bury them. That's the, that's the right order. That's the way things should be. So this one that Nigerian government is doing, please don't be their scapegoat. Don't let them use you. Don't let them make you... Uh, uh, you don't make them um, make you suffer for nothing. Let's support Nandi Kano. Let's help. Um, let's assist very his parents very well. Let's not come there with the intention to make trouble. Because I tell you, the Nigerian government, they are out there to really cause trouble. They are out there to really cause trouble. That's what they are good at. They will not go and do what they are supposed to do. It's to cause trouble. That's where they are very good. That's where, they, that's where you see them. You know, but we're going to show them what uh, true leadership is. We're going to show them how to live. We're going to show them what is the right spirit of leadership and how people ought to comport themselves. We're, we're going to comport ourselves in a well orderly manner and none of the kind of parents will be buried. You know, please, let's come there with a heart to support this man and not to allow the, the Nigerian government to make us, you know, not give this man the maximum and well-befitting barrier that he deserves, you know. I want to say a big thank you to all of you out there who have uh, subscribed. If you have not, please do. Uh, what it does is that it helps this news to travel far and it encourages us to do more. I want to say a big thank you for your support. Thanks. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. We are here to keep you up to date with all that is going on in Nigeria and around the world. You have a voice. You are important. Don't let anybody talk you down or make you feel that you don't have a voice. You have a voice. Please use it. One of the ways you can use it is by commenting. 
commenting on the on our on our on our on the news, uh, clicking on the notification button, liking and sharing, help the news to travel, help the news to go far, so that they can know the injustice that has been done to Nandi Kano, a man out there crying for freedom, you know, for his people. You know, thank you very much, everyone out there. Thanks for listening. I want to say have a lovely and a blessed day. God bless you. You are important. Have a lovely day. Bye.